There we go. All right. Uh, sound alerts. Oh yeah, just to like get it out of the way, I suppose. Start the ad. Long time no see. I know, Zed. I know. <laughs> it's been forever. Oh my god. <laughs> I haven't streamed in so long. <laughs> and yeah, my uh, my starlight is showing. One second. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Man, a long time no see. What's what, what, what Pokemon do I even have? Let's see. Are like going live soon? Yeah, he is. He he just had to restart his computer because it wasn't picking up his controller for a minute. Um, Lillipup, Pat Rat, Glamyow, and Oshawa. That's what I've got. You can follow me. Glamyow is too shy. Oshawa is too shy. Pat Rat will come out. But Lillipup won't. Well, Hands here. Nope, the only one that will is Pat Rat. Hey, hey, Levo! <laughs> How are you doing? I just Fennel was yes. looking for me. <laughs> Where did Fennel tell me to go? Fennel, apparently. Some professor? Too slow. <laughs> oh yeah, here. Juniper asked you to complete the Pokedex. It's a challenge. Got distracted. Bring some of the dream mist from the dream yard. Okay. Okay. <laughs> 
Yeah, Starlight's making a new character. He's just gonna catch up to me. <laughs> Use Pokemon too. I don't think that's where you're supposed to. No, Be Bianca, you're in the wall. Bianca, why? Yeah, Bianca just went into the wall. Same starter. You don't like which one? Oh. Yeah, Tepeg is dumb. Yeah. <laughs> that would be the only good thing about Tepig, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like when you like when you um kill a cow with a fire attack in Breath of the Wild and it just already turns into cooked steaks. Bianca is really stuck in there. Uh. Hmm. Well, it did say the server was under high load. Okay, she's in there now. I'm really, really wondering how showing dreams. for Pokemon or why? So, Levo, are you, are you hanging around still? So the the villains that you say are really based in the third book. Do you mean like do you mean Sahir? <laughs> Yes. Oh, Levo, of course. I, I, I know, Starlight, I, I don't really like any of the characters in Korra. I told you. Trash. 
the villain is Dami Mami. There's a season four. Oh, I, I was really hoping it'd be done after book three. Uh... Aria, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> For Starlight? Yeah. I'm, because I'm a Korra hater. Shit all over his dreams. <laughs> How did I shit all over his dreams? As you hear, all the red lettuce are 100% based. And... Hmm. Yeah, you don't? I guess because he studied all the guru teachings or whatever. story. Yeah. I know it's gonna get high AF off of Dream Mist. <laughs> I don't think that that Tunnel is gonna snort some Freon. <laughs> we kind of did this stuff in the wrong order. Yeah, I think he's talking about Korra. That one was a universe ending. Yeah.
Yeah. Yeah. The mine could have been based, but unfortunately it wasn't. I feel like none of, um... Like, I, th I felt this way in, like, the first Avatar, too. Th though there are exceptions, like, I feel like the villains in general aren't very well written. And I know that's probably gonna, like, make Levo all kinds of pissed because he loves Azula. But... I mean, like, with... With Azula, like, with Azula, it's believable, like, it's believable her, uh, you know, the way she is. And because she comes from the Fire Lord, it's a bit believable for him, too, but I don't feel like any of the villains ever really have a decent motivation. It's always just, I want to take over the world because I want to take people's bending away. That nobody has bending. At least there was a reason with that. Like, you know, at least they actually had an end goal. I want to destroy the universe. Like, he knows he'd gain nothing from it. There's no point. And, like, why is he motivated to do this? Like, what gives him the idea this will be great? He doesn't ever say, like, you just don't understand if you actually studied the spirits, you know, you would know that it's not going to be a bad thing. It's actually going to be good for the world. Like, he doesn't even have that. Oh, they look Well, yeah, it would, it would be actually bad, but I'm saying, like, he doesn't even try to portray that he believes that he is doing the right thing in his own viewpoint. And so it's not believable. What am I saying? I'm saying that I don't think the villains in Avatar and Legend of Korra are very well written. I feel like they don't have actual good motivations for doing things. Korra, yeah, you liked Amon. Is that the guy that was like the equalist or what? Yeah, he's the, the equalist, yeah. Who here's motivation is pretty fine. But I feel like like to be entirely honest with you. I feel like they didn't anticipate doing anything beyond the first two. Because the book three plot seems so rushed and yeah, knowing like, knowing that there's an entire other thing that's going to happen in, in book four just makes me think wow that's definitely going to be rushed too they're not going to have any time for development hey, yeah they blew their lobe with the vatu and rava stuff they did they aren't super villains they're real yeah like, at least, at least, you know, the Equalists have a, a, an actual fucking goal that makes some kind of sense. But Zaheer and his whole group is just like, here's this group of people that's apparently notorious for doing shit that everybody knows of, but hasn't been mentioned up until now, and yet they're all going to escape from prisons that were specially made just to hold them because, you know, of reasons. And they're all gonna get out and get together and they're gonna do this thing that they have reasons for doing, but they hardly freaking explain it. Even even when he tries to explain it, he's just like BSing about it to waste Korra's time so that they can find her. You're heavily abridging the break. The breakout was like one or two episodes, bro. How can you abridge it? How can you abridge 20 minutes? Every prison. You can explain? You may- you maybe very well can explain. There's probably a reason. I just don't think that they- they conveyed it properly in the show. I don't know. 
What's this, daycare? Yeah. You stand in solidarity with comrades in the Red Lotus in their fight against imperialism. Ugh. I'm not willing to be in, like, a call about Avatar, to be honest, like, just, just doing st two streams right next to each other is gonna like, consume the entirety of my mental capacity for today. Oh, I haven't even healed. What do you mean? Oh. I want to remove the avatar and the power over the world it holds. But the avatar is very clearly and explicitly shown to have next to no power in any meaningful way. The leader of Republic City doesn't give a shit about the avatar. The Earth Queen doesn't give a shit about the avatar. Basically the only people that give a shit about the avatar are like the fucking White Lotus and the Beifongs. And people that are related to the old Avatar. Like, that that's fucking about it. Everybody else is just like, you're the Avatar? Uh, yeah, so what? Get the fuck out of my city. Or, here, sit in my prison and rot because you dared to speak out against me. Like, nobody gives a shit about the Avatar. He doesn't hold power over the world. Maybe he'd fucking know that if he hadn't been in prison for the past 13 years. Like, I get it. It's a kid's show. Ultimately, any criticism I have about it can be countered with, It's a kid's show. They can't go super deep into this stuff. It's just a kid's show. And in any case, if they want to remove the Avatar, they should have just left Korra the fuck alone. She already almost ended the fucking line of reincarnation on her own. Like, I'm sure that bitch is gonna trip and Rava's gonna fall out of her. You can feel the knife in Starlight's heart, yeah. It's a kid's show as a cop-out. It is. It is a cop-out. She's making a fair, fair assessment. Hurt me. I mean, I, I just... I just really hate Korra as a character. So much. Aang has more character development in one episode than Korra has in the entire show that I've seen so far. The fucking otter penguins have more character development than fucking Korra. Sorry, I'm triggered. <laughs> yeah, otter penguin would be bomb ass. Pet. They ruined it because... Oh, I see. Yeah, I'm not reading it aloud because then it will confirm to Starlight that I've been spoiled. In, like, even though I already know. But see, Starlight doesn't know. That's the thing. Yeah, it's my first time seeing it and it's his first time seeing the third and fourth books. Hey, preschooler. Why don't you murder your Pokemon? <laughs> yeah. It's not that big a story. Yeah. I really don't like- I, I mean, I don't like how they handled much of anything in this series, but I really hate how they handled relationships in general in Aura. I feel like relationships in Avatar, like, you know, they built up to it throughout the entire show. So, when it finally happened, it felt deserved, but Korra's just like, you're hot. I want to date you, but you're dating somebody else. Oh no, I, I, I guess I'll just make out with you behind their back, and then, like, ten episodes later we'll date. And then we'll break up over stupid reasons, and uh, then I'll forget about it and come back and pretend like I never broke up with you, or that you never broke up with me. Like, it's just, it's it's so stupid. It's so and dumb. And I understand, like, it's supposed to be... It's supposed to be, like... 
you know, they're teenagers. This is teenager relationship drama bullshit. And I understand that. That very much is how teenager relationship drama bullshit goes. But is that the kind of content that we want people relating to on TV? Do we not want to show, like, fucking healthy relationships? Like, the healthiest thing that happens is them realizing it's not going to work between them and just agreeing to drop it. But even so, even so, like, I feel like everything leading up to it was handled so fucking bad. The only th like, the character that I liked the most for her was Bolin. Yeah, where the kid's like, hey, did you know Korra likes Mako? Yeah. See, if they, if they were actually trying to represent true teenager drama bullshit, though, what would have actually happened at that point is a hair pulling, like, like fucking arm scratching, you know, elbow biting fucking cat fight. Like, it would have been, like, a fucking, like, Western cartoon style with a cloud of dust and just limbs poking out from time to time. If they want to do an actual portrayal of teenager drama, that's what they should have done. Yeah. If they wanted to do an actual portrayal of it, Korra and Asami would have thrown hands over Mako. 100%. And that, but instead, instead they were just they were just both totally cool with it, you know. Kura kissed him while he was dating Asami, you know. Uh, Asami kissed him while Kura forgot that he broke up with her. Like it's just, and and yet they're both just like, oh yeah, I'm so glad it didn't come between us being girlfriends. Ha ha ha! Let's go shopping to the mall in this car that I just learned how to drive because you invented it, or your daddy invented it with his weird steampunk shit. Like it, it's just so dumb. It's like they tried to have some girl power fucking friendship, but I don't understand. Like, have any of these writers actually seen uh, a, a, a friendship between two women? Like, have they ever s seen that occur? Are you so mad? I love it. Yeah, this is this is what happens. This is what happens every night when I when I have to sit through like three episodes of Korra. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I'm just kidding. <laughs> Angry stream, but <laughs> rage mode, yes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get cancelled. I'm gonna get cancelled. They're gonna be like, ah, she doesn't like Korra, cancel her. <laughs> Both have a trio badge, let's see which is stronger. Uh... You're gonna get my, my nerd rage. <laughs> Re. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. They even say that I think their entire goal is not Yeah. They want to. Yeah. But they're better. Is it here? Can I die? Yeah. You can pinpoint the moment. What? What? It, what? It, what is this? You pinpoint the moment his heart breaks. What? I'm so mad. I love it. Yeah. This is this is what happens. This is what happens every night when I when I have to sit through like three episodes of Korra. Hey. <laughs> Oh, you'll have to look at it yourself. 
<laughs> That's good. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, Starlight. <laughs> it's out of context. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you will. <laughs> oh. Oh, uh, Levo, put it in your Discord. Why were you running? <laughs> Heck yeah, potion. <laughs> what? <laughs> Mr. Jimmy. Yeah, he's dead. Willapup kind of cute, though. And that would be what? God. I think there's supposed to be a ROM hack of Pokemon where Team Rocket kills people. Yeah, and, and like, you, there's one where you play as Team Rocket too, it might be the same one. Cool. And steal people's Pokemon? Yeah. Rocket Edition is so good, is it? But you get I see. Feel Pokemon and rob houses. Oh, Blitzel. Steal dig from. <laughs> you tracked. Oh my god, is that what you do in Rocket Edition? No, no, I, I can't say it. I don't want to get canceled. <laughs> Apparently, you track down sex workers. And Rocket runs a prostitution ring. I mean, that explains their female rocket employee outfit. Oh yeah, I did. <laughs> oh yeah. You have a crush on Jesse? No? You have a crush on James with hands? <laughs> Thank you. 
place on the ship, Captain, to rob him. That's why he's sick when you see him. Oh. I see. The ship captain. On the SSN. Dinner. Yeah, but I'm slow, so that'll be easy for you. Yeah, you do. On double battle. I forgot to turn uh, Ixper on though. Not that it really matters, there's nobody really in here. Oh yeah? Actually, try to go Oh, come on. That takes so long. Yeah. But that also wouldn't work. Half the book. First gen. Yeah. So that could... I tried to do it. Whooper! win the entirety of Pokemon or one whoopy boy. This is a preschool. Oh, 
Where am I headed from here? Yeah. Left and down. Thank you for the hug! The pup is evolving! Pupper! Doggo. Keep watching the clip and your maniacal laugh at the end! Levo! <laughs> Not maniacal, come on! What the... No! That's not that bad. I think you gotta be careful, it would be two Pokemon, but it's not that bad. Maybe you should go to bed, Levo. I mean, pretty sleepy, right? Don't you need rest? Sleep is not for the weak. Sleep is for big boys. Big boy sleeps.
Thank you. Oh. No ice crystal. No. It's only two more hours till stream? What do you mean two more hours till stream? Thank you, though. Yeah, Mason stream? Is that what you mean? So you're just saying that you can't you can't sleep, Zed, because you have to stay up for Masons? Fucking with Levo, how he's never made a Mason stream. Oh true, yeah, I guess he hasn't. I just feel like there's not enough Pokemon in this. Everywhere I go, I just see the same Pokemon. The only new thing I've seen is Padov. Yeah. Yeah, Pokemon that aren't fifth gun. I mean, there is, there, there is. There is. Sorry, though. Yeah? Oh, yeah. So it's like the pal part. It was just, it depends on, like, anybody would have their own pal park and, you know, you'd be, like, looking up who had the pal park you wanted on any particular day and then just go, oh, go get there. Yeah. I remember if you were trying to... That's why. Oh, come on, Sharon. It's so hard. Wow. You think I couldn't have walked down the street by myself? Okay, Freaking I nerd. I guess I'm gonna have to find a different background. I can't keep using my spooky background. Yeah, I can for a little bit more. I'm just saying I should look for a new one. Is this how it was in the game? A fence on fucking train tracks? Okay. Making sure. Ah. Uh. Just 
Notice I think the out the train. Aqua. Magma. Yeah. I see. Oh. Mm -hmm. this might be hard for you. Probably. Second Like Okay, well then I'll go grind more. No big deal. I don't. What fighting type would I have? What could I possibly have caught up till now? Like, fucking Sharon said that too, but it's like, literally, what fighting type exists that I could have caught right by now? I don't think there's a fighting type. Levo, I am concerned. Levo. Levo. Trying to play, you're trying to sweep both sides of the steps here. <laughs> yeah, that, I don't think that's not exactly what I meant, but. <laughs> he said uh, he said he was lying and he's gonna be the top <laughs> oh wow all right but only as long as I can film it and you guys get oiled up first I mean yeah I mean in it's gonna take a minute for one of you to get tired out. It'll be like an anime boss battle when you <laughs> when you have sex. <laughs> God. I mean, after stream? Yeah, sure. Yeah. I want some. Oh yeah? Well, I can even get in the second jump. If I can even get into the second gym. I don't think I'm going to be able to. Wait, have you two been playing together this whole time? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was
Levo. You haven't noticed. Oh, ouch. Here we go. Oh, I guess I have one hit point left on her dear. Not that it's gonna help. I know. Or I could just go grind. I guess I'm gonna have to go I back mean, out here. Pedoves? Okay. Forward battle! That's new, actually. Yeah. Or else it would be absolutely Yeah. Especially if you're there. Yeah. It would just suck. Don't have an electric type move yet. No, not until the Yeah, you think? You think you're gonna catch up? <laughs> Okay. The courier actually has the attack speed. 
Yeah? Oh, I see. Yeah. Next Pokemon comes out and it's Ali, full of attack. Yeah. Set up the power. Ali. Yeah. Hundred power with same hyper beam. Odd. Good, I hope it's only two. For your... Watch out. Oh, okay. The evolved thing of Pat Rat, yeah. I think that would be cringy. A time for little boys. Oh. Okay. Good night, Levo. Yeah, Levo is small. Levo is small bean. How do I figure? Cause look at him, he's a small precious bean. Night Levo. Hey, Toasted me. I toasted? Yeah, awesome. Hey, Lodge. Hey, how you doing? So straight, so hello. <laughs> Probably. Yeah, I think he can usually hear you. Good, hope you're having a good night. Yeah, I'm having a great night. Thank you for popping in. Raid hype. <laughs> night oh, Levo. Raid. Yeah, I mean like it just said hosted, but I guess I guess it was a raid. On the mini feed it just said hosted, but thank you, thank you for the raid. I can't believe it's it's the first time Lotch has chatted in here. Oh, yeah. yeah? Happened to me. Oh, she went into the wall? Oh no, Bianca really does like going into that wall. Well yeah, thanks for popping in, Lotch. Did you, um... Were you, uh... Still wondering about that Digimon... Digimon Masters Online? Is that what it was? Never got the chance to stop by while you're live? Yeah! But now I am. Um, I'm gonna be live for like almost an hour or more. Cause I got it, I got it downloaded. So does Starlight. Apparently, I tried it once before years ago. I tried it for like eight minutes, so <laughs> it wasn't it wasn't a very good attempt. Message me on Discord about it. Okay, cool. And then Zed is gonna um, try to help me with that Discord reactive text thing, or I'm gonna try to figure it out. Got me the link for it, so.
Hmm. Yeah, I feel like Gen 5 is definitely, definitely slower. It's not too hard to set up your avatar to fully work on your stream as well. Oh yeah? Really? That would be awesome. Yeah. Oh yeah? <laughs> Yeah, but I, I wonder how that would work because it tries to animate them. I mean, I guess some of the Moemon and Spice are animated. I mean, there are. Have I know they do have animated Moemon sprites. Yeah, they have both. Yeah. Which the battle sprites do. Nice. I I don't want to play Moemon on Poke MMO though. At least if it's regular Pokemon, then I'm not as embarrassed when people come in. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Because of Miltank, Mommy. <laughs> yeah, Articuno was, was also pretty Mommy material. It's got some hot takes over here. No. For sure not. People come in here and we're just talking about base sitting. Nothing wrong with that, huh? In Japan, they sell those lap pillows. I'm surprised that nobody sells like booty pillows. Somebody must. Yeah. Like it's a cushion that's sewn to re like resemble the form of you know a lap. And they the different colors like they they come with different skirt colors and stuff. <laughs> But, but, you know, that's Japan. That's craziness from Japan. That's true. I think, I think it's, I think it's Snap. Snaps or something. Actual, actual big brain idea. What, booty pillows? <laughs> I'm sure it must exist. But who would not want to snooze on a nice, soft, fat, dumpy, huh?
Like, how, how can you not want to just lay your head on some nice soft cheeks? Uh, yeah. That's, that's an Japanese. Scratch and sniffs. Oh, no. <laughs> no. That's a Japanese. Okay, so it's gonna it's gonna be a booty pillow. It's gonna be a booty pillow. But then when, yeah, it exists. I knew it. I knew it. And I bet I bet it comes with like panties, so you can cover up its its booty crack when your friends come over, because you definitely have friends if you have a booty pillow. <laughs> they lay on your booty pillow and they're like, man, it's kind of crusty. <laughs> Exist, you just found it. Oh, Lotch, no! <laughs> oh. the best pick to go with it, where should you send? <laughs> um, I don't, I don't know, you can send it to me on Discord. Or put it in memes, if you're in my Discord. Wait, is Lotch in my Discord? Hang on. There we go. If you're not in my Discord and you want to be, uh, that is the invite link. Suppose I'll heal and buy some more balls. <laughs> Alright, I'll take you up on that later. Yeah, you said that. But you did. Okay, thank you. Oh, I see. All right, there we go. Spent all my Poke Dollars. Feel when Professor Fennel won't leave you alone. Right. Where did you put it? On, uh... Oh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, I see it now. Oh gosh, Starlight, look at that. Memes chat, oh gosh. Yeah, that, that, that sure is, that sure is a comfy looking pillow. You, you, you could, you could just stuff your, uh, face right into those cheeks. <laughs> Breathable face sitting. <laughs> You have to add waste to the other side so that you almost, you know, suffocate. Just, just get a, just get a like a bendy crazy straw and use that for air. <laughs> Somebody, like an assassin, comes and tries to smother you to death with a pillow, but they can't do it because you're too experienced in breathing through someone's cheek. You just yes. can't be smothered to death. You're immune. Like no, you just you get off on asphyxiation and you're just like, oh, don't stop. <laughs> the fucking the, the fucking assassin be like, what? I don't get paid enough for that. Thomas, I think he 
does. To be honest, you think they do? Really? You think they do? You think they get paid enough to deal with their target, you know, hitting the big nut? <laughs> as long as the target's dead. As long as the target's dead. If, okay, as long as the target's dead, it doesn't matter if they died a little too happy, I guess. Hey, at least, at least the assassin's <laughs> I mean, probably doesn't be bad. But he can still rule bad, don't he? Right, Oh, goodness. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm sorry for all the lewd lodge. I'm sorry. <laughs> I think it's quite my. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> then he says something... Well, kind of. Still want somebody in that tip to my job. Uh... Family guy. I think Family Guy is awesome. Family Guy is like, sometimes, sometimes it's good, but it's it's got a lot of like mid to lower tier episodes, in my opinion. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It is kind of crazy, yeah. One Piece has like... One Piece has like a billion fucking episodes. I mean, they're almost to thousands. There's thousand episode? They should be- if anybody has a show of like, I guess to a thousand episodes, they should just be like, Alright, you better wrap the fucking plot up by now, come on. What about that show we were on going on the edit? Like, I didn't have, like, 1,400 fucking episodes or something. 14,000. Oh, God. 14,000? He's... And there was... They were an hour long. came <laughs> out, like... I looked at it and said it was, like, 19. Still going on. That's crazy. I wonder who's financing that. My gosh, that must be expensive. I wonder... I wonder... Not even a very popular. Not here in person. Yeah. Yeah, edgy sniping. I see. <laughs> oh, I really, I really should have turned my my Dixper thing on. I didn't know that I was going to be getting raided. Maybe I can. I can turn it on. All I have to do is tell it to. More time to catch up, is that so? Hmm. Oh, never mind. What? Oh, he removed you? Sad. Unless your friends look 
character. Yeah, it must be. There we go, it finally picked up the game. Okay. Let me... That could drop on there. I don't know, it's it's three though, so you can get one if you want. I mean, you're streaming though. I don't know. It's not? It works on mobile? Huh. I oh. Think wow. This ride needs just being a stinker. I mean, it does. Out. Yeah. Straight out. Yeah. Man, typical kids these days just don't have the attention span to actually read on their magical light tube. It's just fucking. Uh, I mean, I guess people don't in general. I mean, RuneScape got in trouble for that one. RuneScape was like just starting out and stuff. Yeah. Them? Text yeah, them? Like, when I was like 10. Oh. They still had memory. How you got your memory. And then text them. Yeah. Yeah. And I used this. I used. I used. I used. I'm on route. I go to a mall. Like, I'm lost. I know, you told me. Can I use your phone? Can I use your... Oh, gosh. What, 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 what a dick, kid. Hey! <laughs> what? It's true. Oh my god, the things you do for RuneScape Premium, huh? Yeah. It's it's like it's only a few steps away from turning tricks behind a 7-Eleven. <laughs> he hasn't denied that. Yeah, that's just shady. They, they got Good. They're the largest kind of all time. Yeah. So it didn't really hurt their <laughs> Yeah, but as long as they faced, like... They know. faced the consequences. Um, a lot of people think the law was... Yeah. Yeah. 
work. As well as it has to be right. Yeah. Not just thing. them, but I mean, like, I remember, them, I remember, like, the whole charging stuff to your phone bill thing, but, like, Gaia Online would do that all the time. You wanted to donate for your Gaia items, charge it right to your phone bill. I still remember. Yeah? Yeah. They had that whole thing. Yeah. They did like five or seven, five to seven. But somebody. But it wouldn't work. But they don't have a bill. Yeah. Still go. But then after seven months. Everybody who had people. Yeah. The thing that I really hated was places banning prepaid cards because like you know, like places that wanna auto bill you and shit and they're like, No, you can't use a prepaid card for this, but it's like okay, but I know it's gonna be a pain in the ass to cancel it and I'm probably gonna fucking forget, so I'd really rather use a prepaid card. They're not allowed to look not let you use prepaid cards? Like, I think with the, like, privacy.com and stuff, they kind of allow you to use temporary cards for each vendor, so... But I suppose it would make sense, um, focus energy? I kind of don't want that. Should I take it? I mean... I'm gonna get rid of it eventually. Anyways. Yeah. It's better than Hell Whip. Yeah. Hold the paint. Oh no. Probably not if I find anything better. Or something. But really, like, it's it's that Visa and MasterCard and the provider of the prepaid cards were like, hey, if you don't accept all of the cards we make, you're not accepting any of the cards we make. Because especially when prepaid cards started getting a lot bigger, you know, because a lot of people would get them for holidays and birthdays and stuff and then find you can't use them hardly fucking anywhere. Yeah. I mean, they already had reload. Yeah. Had, like, a $20 Domino's already had. Yeah. That you could pack on. Add more. Like if you got it, 
Yeah. They probably rule the country worse than big farmers. Guess who does big farmers finance? Try to reach the tax card. They have to. Yeah, everybody does. It's all the same network handling the fucking financial backbone of the country. So at least it goes uh, faster. That's that's a lot of the problem that people have been having with like um sex workers online and stuff. OnlyFans people. Because payment processors are like, oh we don't want to be associated with adult content. And if a big payment processor like Visa or MasterCard decides to raise that concern, there's literally nothing you can say to them. It's either you work with them or you don't work. There's like, there's hardly any other fucking alternatives that aren't routing through them in some way. And if they don't want you using their shit, you're not gonna use it. They'll find a way to get out, to get you out of there. Company I've ever seen kind of allows that, that we can buy yeah. <clears throat> because apparently a lot of trucking. Star. Oh. And like our system doesn't take CoStar, like our agent. Yeah. The Chevron does. Hmm. A ATMs. But our system. But they have to go to the cash out. But CoStar is like. You don't see it very often because. Oh. They don't. can't get a personal. You have to get a Oh, I see. It's a company. I just realized I ran all the way. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But my boss is Yeah. Look we'll at all pissed off about anything. I had a lady. I, I don't think I mentioned the other day on Friday. Yeah. I had a lady. Oh, I played about. Why? Not because she wanted to pay. She actually wanted to pay. Okay. And she said. And she was yelling at me and yelled at my boss. Like, why does it have to end at 77? Bad. God. I was like, I want to see your manager. Hmm. That's so dumb. The, the lady ended up, and we had already made her order. Cars in. Yeah. Right already made her order. Ready to go. Cancel it. Jeez. Because my boss would not. Like, my boss said, yeah, I, I'm willing to do this if you want it. No. What came out to be that was a that was a bad time. And then like turned her car on. Yeah. 
dollars. People will straight up just like, yeah, yeah, no. That's my order. They'll leave. Please. I've had cashiers try to get me to buy extra stuff at stores when my totals ended in 666. say anything cancel worthy but how are you gonna like believe in a god that's like omnipresent and omnipotent and think he's gonna be offended by something like that like how is he about to be offended by an arrangement of numbers that, that you have nothing to do with in any direct way like I, I just don't see that I don't see that logic but I guess you know that's the whole thing you know logic isn't involved in much of that I don't know. I mean, people don't like uh, when other people say offensive or contentious things. Like, you know, if someone... If... Yeah, but it's not like I'm not well-educated enough in religion to, like, defend my opinions against some debate bro, and I don't want to attract that type of person by talking about it, you know? Yeah. And I imagine you're probably pretty educated enough on it, seeing as you were, like, youth group leader. Hey, I was a lot of people. Yeah. 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 Rip. I really would love- like, I know that I'm probably not going to be able to. But it would be amazing to stream Genshin someday because the- the Dixper collection for Genshin is really good. It's like, it'll, um, make- force your character to dash, force your character to go in one specific direction. Or, like, spawn a little icon that makes you think there's a loot somewhere around, but then it disappears. Like, it, it's just, like, absolute great troll stuff. Awesome. And, it, and it's like, um, if they're, if they're doing, like, drops, you can, you can freak the person out and, like, make them think they got something rarer than they did. Start losing their shit. It's just like, ah, uh, it's just like some some high quality trolling waiting to happen. I'm gonna need to get the, the PC fixed up before my crying until I pull Venti stream. Yeah, um. Doesn't. 
for it. I changed my Pokemon. Yeah? Red beat. Yeah? Sends out Tepic. Oh, I see. I'm trying to show you that he went to trainer school. It's a baby game. Black and white. It's a baby game for babies. Twitch chat has managed to beat the Pokemon games. Uh, no. They did once. I'm pretty sure they got Hall of Fame the first time it happened. It took them forever, but they did. Which one? Pokemon? Yeah. They, they only got past the fourth gym. They never really? Let me see. The game was completed after more than 16 continuous days of gameplay. What? After 16 days, the hive consciousness of Twitch plays Pokemon has successfully beaten Pokemon Red. Early this morning, thousands of chat participants navigated through the final fight with Blue, a major milestone in a social experiment that has effectively turned Twitch TV into a huge crowdsourced gaming platform. Yeah, they beat it. They beat it. They... I didn't think they did. I thought they got so far. No, 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 they beat it. Only them... Yeah, it only took him 16 days. Wow. So look, if Twitch chat can beat Pokemon, you know, how, you know the IQ of, like, collective Twitch chat. <laughs> about... Yeah, all of them together, sure, they have a lot. But, like, what's the average across each of them? there's gonna be a lot of people that are dragging the average down, I'm pretty yeah, sure. I know, yeah, it was set up, it had to be set up like really in a particular way. Some guy had to set up like an actual cat bot. That was a third party bot with cat and Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there are multiple multiple people that do Twitch plays Pokemon or similar stuff now, but the thing is, since there's so many people doing it, it's all spread out and like the people in the chat can actually like legitimately play it. Yeah. Cause it's not just like one million fucking people in the one chat. I can actually play it.
What's up? I love my chair, thank you. I know, now we both get chairs. <laughs> yeah. Now you're not gonna... Yeah, now you're not gonna get yeeted. Yeah? Oof. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, maybe it just getting lifted around so much. I see. Yeah. Hey, King Ghost. How are you doing? How was your Halloween? Doing good? You got a Hershey bar? Nice. Hey, are you, um... Are you on PC by any chance? Or actually, Starlight says it works on mobile. Here, if you want to interact with the stream and play around with these, there's a few drops there. I don't think anybody got any of them. You can, like, put voice changers on me and have, have my screen be painted over. Like, lots of stuff. Let me... I was hoping. You're on mobile. It's okay, it works on mobile. There we go. Really want yeah, they really want you to download the app, but you don't have to. How do you do it? You just click the link and it'll ask you to download the app and you just look around for a little gray text that says like skip downloading the app and it should open up the web page for you and you'll be able to log in with Twitch and get the crate and it'll give you a couple random effects that you can apply to the stream like one of them might be a voice changer that makes me sound like I'm talking through a megaphone or one of them might be uh, you know uh, bubbles that go all over my screen or a spider that crawls across my screen stuff like that. Yeah, the paint one looks really the cool. Yeah. That one. Oh. Epic drop. Got Aria loot boxes. Starlight loot. Yeah. Can't do that, your brain can't handle it? Oh, that's okay. I understand. Uh -oh. Yeah? If I can carry. <laughs> if you can beat him. And again, I don't have as much. I'm one. Pokemon? Only catch. Hmm. Have you ever done a Minecraft stream? Oh, I would love to do a Minecraft stream. I actually was talking about that earlier. Um, it's gonna be a, a donation goal, I think. Or maybe a sub goal, once I get to a certain amount of subs. But, but Starlight and I have already looked it up. The server that we want would be around $25 a month, right? 
So. I mean, that is the only one that means backup. There's no backups at all? Oh. Well, automatic backup. Oh. Either that or $45 a month. Yeah. Yes, you need. How do you so. <laughs> I mean. I think you you have to uh to sub you have to have like an Amazon Prime and link it to your Twitch or you can just press the subscribe button. It's like five dollars. <laughs> but but I'm trying to get like um you know I want to be able to pay for the server like from my streaming. You you do know how? Yeah. Yeah, just click the subscribe button underneath um, where it plays my video. Tell them that I'm, I'm a... Yeah. Yeah, it's 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 a better deal if you if you use the Twitch Prime or the Amazon Prime because you know. But yeah, I wanted I wanted to pay with it for with my you know stuff from streaming, and I have like so basically whenever I get my first Twitch payout, you'll gift five subs. Ooh, wow! I don't know how to gift subs. I I know there's a button. I think once you're subscribed, the subscribe button changes to gift subs instead of subscribe yourself. But I would be playing modded Minecraft, it won't be vanilla Minecraft. Um, oh, mom said no spending until Christmas. <laughs> That's okay. But I'm playing them, I'm gonna be playing the mod pack uh, Dungeons, Dragons, and Space Shuttles, which has basically everything in it. Like, yeah, liter literally basically everything that you could put in Minecraft is in there. Yeah, it's almost 500 months. <laughs> Do Pixelmon? Um, yeah, a friend has a Pixelmon server up. I could do Pixelmon. Everybody wants oh, Everybody does want Pixelmon. I've never played it before. Is it is it really fun? I mean, like, is, is all the Pokemon in it? Yeah, Pokemon. And is and and is the world just randomly generated then, like Minecraft or what? Yeah, Are there towns? Like uh, there's towns. Towns have. Pokemon. How do you buy Pokeballs? Like, what's the they currency? What's the currency, though? How do you get it? How do you get it? Do you actually battle NPCs? Yeah, there's them scattered about the world. It does? Even legendaries? Oh, okay, okay. Let's poke a center across the map. You can make and buy Pokeballs, huh? Oh yeah, you can make them. Make that. So that thing. Yeah. Say you make Castor Balls, you have to get all the right? Yeah. And then the final component. Well, you actually have to find this as the next ball quest. It even has battle cutscenes, like like attack animations. Huh. And you can battle NPCs in the map. Oh, okay. I mean, they're kinda wonky. Kinda wonky? Because it doesn't go into a cutscene. I see. You got a Zapdos in your Pixelmon server? I mean, I th I'm pretty sure that Frost would be okay with, like, you know, anybody playing on his... So, I mean, m maybe I, w I mean, he did invite me, so... I'm sure he's to totally okay. As long as they're not trolls. Yeah, as long as they're not trolls. How do you know if somebody's a troll in Minecraft? I don't know. Uh... Oh, I 
see. You can also trade, huh? Do you have to catch water Pokemon in the water? They're water based, they're just like fishes. What do you where do you find bird Pokemon? Mm. A rock Pokemon only in caves? Caves and um Most Pokemon are based off of biome. So oh, based like off of biome, okay. Like Aeron and... And is there, there's, you can still do the typical Minecraft stuff. You can build your, you know, build whatever you want. Yeah, you can Minecraft with all the basic ones. You can also just throw Pokeballs at Pokemon if you don't want to attack it. Ah. Pokemon Go style. shot. Yep, because um, I only got a couple minutes left. Uh -oh. Seriously, people forget Pokemon Go, you still play it? Um, oh, we're right. I still have to get through N. I guess this is going to be the last thing I do on my stream is N. Some people do flex, be warned. What do you mean flex? Like in Pixelmon? I mean, somebody would have to play on the same server as me to catch Pixelmon to flex on me with, so... Flex their legendary or shinies. Oh, I see. Is the shiny rate still at the normal rate? The starter choices are all the gen starters. Oh, okay, so it's like crystal clear. Yeah, I'm still not even gonna get past N. Oh wait, that's the fighting type. Timber? The one percent. One percent? Ah. On like, oh, I am. One flex the shiny right. Machamp on you. I don't know who's online. But I have to, you know, go load my browser and stuff. To see. Oh, I'm, I'm really, I'm really like craving like cherry pie. Maybe. There, like some mega boss Pokemon spawn on the map and give them a battle until it gets to catch it. Oh, I see. I mean, it sounds fun. Okay. 
I will as soon as I'm finished just killing me. <laughs> what? No. You had a Mega Venusaur? Oh, yeah. Is Mega Pokemon in there? Oh. Ooh, yeah, Megas are superior to most of the Pokemon gimmicks through the years. Well, I mean, straight up. Oh. There. Mega watches that can Mega evolve your Pokemon? Nice. Um. Oh, uh, no, not that. Uh. You think. Crash. Yeah, make them sleepy. There's even crates. There's loot crates and Pixelmon. Hey, that guy loves Reshiram! I have a video for him. <laughs> Where do you use your daily keys to open chests for random time? Called the shiny egg where it hatches this. Ooh. Okay, who do I have? Yuki. Uh, I guess I can read into this person that I was watching. That plays New Sorry, Vegas. Oh, okay. Um. Here's the there you go. Let's go sleepy schedule. So if, so if you get it, flex it. Ooh. All right. Thank you, everyone, for stopping by and sticking around. If you'd like to join the Discord and you're not already a member, I will drop the link in chat one last time. We're going to raid into Katie Caliber. She's playing Fallout New Vegas. Always has oh, yeah, a fun time. Uh, usually throws some corpses around. It's 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 a bop. Let's go over there. <laughs> Oof already. I know. But it's two hour mark. It's the two hour mark. Yeah. It's like, I'll be back tomorrow. It's okay. <laughs> Alright. So we're going to raid into Katie and wish them a great stream.